Welcome back Hi. to Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders. So, in a new area, looked around, saw some cool things. Now, with those cool things, we can make some cool things. So, for one, we found pumice. Um, right outside that teleportal, if you just go up on the hills, right on either side of the little water channel area, the area up top, Nice green grass, sticks everywhere, pumice everywhere, bodkin everywhere. But yeah, they're all right up there. So, that's not what I'm looking for. Um, plenty of pumice to make a filter fountain. And then we gotta take this filter fountain, and we gotta put it in the water. Some rank looking water. Let's see if we can't make this look a smidge nicer. I mean, it's still dirt, but at least it's not poison. And now the water is clean! Yeah, that's the problem. I mean, I got rocks, but I don't know if that's gonna cut it. Yeah. Okay, so for the filter fountain, um, whoops. For the filter fountain, if you want to... Where's my bucket? If you want to scoop up the water, you can't just jump in the water connected to it, because I use the bucket way over here, and I just get water. But if I use the... If I, like, stand butt up against it, I get pure water. That took me a little while to figure out what you had to do. But yeah, now we have pure water. None of that garbagey, minerally crap. Just nothing but H2O. What else can we make? Oh, we got the rusty nuggets. And the rusty nuggets let us not make anything there. We actually have to go to the loom, for whatever reason. But we can make an iron axe! An even better axe. And an iron broadsword! Which, you'll notice, only has an attack plus 26, so it's not doesn't do as much damage as the 30. But man, for fighting... Yeah, I'm, like, never gonna use that again. Like, for fighting, nothing beats an arc. What else did we get? Oh, we can make the shovel. Let's go ahead and make a shovel. Never know when you need a shovel. I'm glad I got those eight rusty nuggets, and for the most part, everything here only takes one. Um, I can also make the better doors. 
so we can think about that at some point. So what else do we have here going for us? There is... We gotta nurse people back to health. So that's what Ellie wants. That guy wants the brick barbecue. We kinda need bricks for that, and I know just where to get them. Gerontus wants... That's kind of our long-term long goal. Do we have wheat? I swear we have wheat. And I did see it. It's out there. I know it is. Maybe this is just the first time we saw it. I could have sworn I saw it all. Or maybe I just used all of it. Who knows? Yeah, right up, uh, right up here. Wait. Wow, that is actually my first wheat. Really? Maybe I already knew how to make bread since I've had wheat before. Oh, you're wheat. There's not really anything else of note up here. There's bodkins. Sticks. Uh, these guys here are the uh, slimes. Anytime you see a weird, out-of-place dirt block. Like that, like that guy. Mimic slime. Yeah, like two of them there. Okay, I think I got a lot of wheat at this point, so we should probably hop on down. It's also getting late. Man, what I wouldn't get for those featherfall boots. So now that we have wheat... Ooh, maybe I have to make a brick barbecue before I can make wheat. guy wants fries. Okay, I need some potatoes. I think I need the barbecue for a lot of that. Yeah, wow, that's it. Okay, barbecue, next plan. So barbecue is the next plan. We have pretty much everything we need to make that barbecue. Except bricks, which, you know, brick barbecue. Bricks, kind of important to the whole brick barbecue thing. Uh, it's not a dirt barbecue, it's a brick barbecue. Any food? Oh, I'm running a lot of food. I gotta check what they've been making. All these green crabs everywhere. Guess what I got? Got a sword! Hack at all of you and kill all of you, one after the other. I don't care if I'm half dead. I murdered the lot of them. Okay, you cannot collect those. So be wary. You see the uh, plumberries and what looks like a plumberry tree? That's Trent. Just remember, there are no plumberry trees here aren't any here. If you think there's one, it's not. It's a trick. So last time, we were just out here. Um, I'm gonna have to start dipping into my plum berries, though. Can I eat that raw? I got a lot of food that I can't eat raw. Oh, I can eat these raw. Wow, not much, though. Yeah, I'm gonna have to refresh on my foodins next time we get back to town. So we came here last time. Big ol' fortification, bricks everywhere. And maybe we can find some nice things. Okay. 
Enough of that. Yeah, not a lot going on over here. What about over here? Ooh. Pile bones. Don't care. Yep, not seen anything in the much in the way down here, but I see that chest. And see the light. Well, if there's not much in the way of that here, look at that. See, this is one of the coolest things going. And let me tell you why. You know, when I'm not. Man, dang it. It's supposed to be the red guy that gets back up. He did get back up. Dang it. There, we did it. This is one of the coolest things, and let me tell you why. You get a lot of different biomes. You gotta come up with a lot of different biomes, but there's always the standards. You got a forest, you got a hot area, you got a jungle, you got a swamp, you got a desert. Who in the world ever thought up a brick biome? It's just a brick biome. It's just bricks. Everywhere bricks. Bricks make up the land. How did they get here? It's not even like, oh, they paved a road. It's like, no, it's just all bricks. See, these guys dropped something, and I forget what, but I remember it being really annoying when I was trying to remember, what, trying to figure out what it was that I needed. This is also where you're going to be getting your rusty nuggets. Potatoes! Don't want buttons. Man, we gotta learn how to make our own, we to grow our own crops. It's gonna be great. Like, it, this, the cool thing here is not even that, like, oh, they paved a bunch of roads or anything. It's, they, the land is just brick. It's just what it is. It's brick. Oh, there's a castle here, and this may be but what Gerontus told us about. So let's take a quick look around. There's a lot of bricks in there. And we do need a lot of bricks. So, I am going to be taking a lot of these bricks with me. But I wanted to take a look around, see if there's anything else going on. Doesn't look like it. He's going to get back up. That's another slime mint. Red guy, got an arch. Brick arch. There's like a little bit of dirt around. Don't know why. Like somebody just got a little ex overexcited with the brick cladding. You know what, let's go ahead and get some of our first bricks. Bricks. Okay. Well, I was thinking maybe there was something inside. There's not. What are you? Ooh. Ah, the door is open. I eat some first, and then I save some for last. Like, it's not only about anticipation, it's when you're done eating, whatever you ate last is the... It kind of sticks in your mouth for a while. It's the flavor that you're left with. It's the memory you're left with. 
So more so than savoring it for last, it'll stick with you for longer if you eat it last. Get more bang for your buck. So you just gotta eat fast. Eat it up! Hey, I've been there. Hey, I may know that chef. Oh yeah, butterbean. Mmm, and potato. Okay, okay, okay. So we've got the rude. What else do we have here? There's you up there. There's you. There's a cave here, though. Let's check out this cave. We'll find something interesting. There is... Kind of as before. Ooh, that may be it. Might as well grab the items I can. Well, three of them. Y'all done? I got a window! Um, that- ooh. Came out of nowhere, but boy do I know what he is. Okay, so I think there's only the one hidden in a cave treasure around here, and it is random where it ends up. But it's those windows! Man, you know what I could go for? A bed. Oh, I can climb up there. Maybe he's got a bed. I'm kind of glad that fireball hit a tree. Do I? No, I just have potatoes. Can you get a potato spot? I don't know, we'll figure it out. So I guess we're still just pl plowing on ahead and seeing what else we can find out here in the brick desert. No sleeping slimes. Oh yeah, look at that noise. That looks pretty cool. I'll have to check that out later. Alright, I think that's pretty much it for the general area of the Brick Desert. There is some other stuff you can find, which is kind of neat. Um, like if you go up here, I think I'm just on the other side of that area. Yeah, okay. So that didn't actually help me at all, but whatever. Oh, maybe those guys are the idiots to keep hitting me with the fireball. No, actually, I'm willing to bet it's, um, willing to bet it's the wizards. Alright, so... Ruby's down there. Trying to find a good, easy way to get up on top of this. Oh, that may be something. I made it. 
Okay, so now that we're up here... So that's over there, that's where we saw the key. Or the little building that needed the key. Can't really see anything in that direction. Other than more brick stuff. Let's hang out up here for just a moment, though. Yeah, it was right over there. Okay, I think I got that far. And that's pretty much the end. Oh, um, funny thing to note. Uh, I can get down here, I did. Grab me a petite. Okay, not feeling too bad. Hey, there's a little building out here. And more pumpkins. Hey, you know what I have? I got a shovel. Wrong button. Really? You're a shovel! Fine, be that way. Yeah, there's a building out here. And... What did I walk in on? Hmm... You know what? I... Bunch of people fall into the... fall into the blight? Are they actually, like... Actual people that, ha that have fallen to the blight? They came here looking for salvation. Someone trying to... Cure the blight. And though they may not be dead, that looks like looks like that's about it. Doesn't seem like there's much we can do here, though. So as a heads up, if you look at the map, look at the world map. You'll see this is the little area we're on right here, and where we are right now is on this little island. We're in the far upper left corner. So you see that tiny little thing, like a finger sticking out into the ocean, very near that island in the middle with the ominous-looking castle on it. In the original Dragon Warrior, this is the location that you had to use the Rainbow Drop or Rainbow Bridge or what have you in order to create the passage over to the Dragon Lord's castle, which, honestly, I'm very surprised you can't see. But I guess maybe this game only keeps the individual chapters loaded at a time.
That's about it for here, though. So from here, it seems like our goal is Gerontus gave us our location. We saw it not long ago, so we can knock that out. We can grab some bricks, because we still need bricks. Thankfully, getting bricks is pretty easy when they're part of the landscape. I don't know how many bricks we're gonna need, but... It's okay, I have a better weapon. Jeez, this thing can one-shot him. I about don't need it. Just friggin' wreck. By it, I mean the charge attack. Okay, we have at least a full stack. So what's going on here? to honor all those that have fallen. Oh, that's rough. Like the guy here must have fallen apart either defending this place or just rusting from time. Trying to stay by his maker. So we should have plenty of something or other. Brick. Brick, that's the thing. We should have plenty of brick, so that's pretty cool. I'm gonna put a lot of this away because we don't need all of this on us at all times. And the last thing for us out here is to go see what Gerontus wanted us to get out of this castle. Here, I can make I can make full sentences sometimes without having to, like, pause a great deal. It's because I'm thinking. I'm trying to, like, formulate my words well. Oh, it's getting nighttime. This is not gonna end well. The Mind Flare! Ah! Ow, jeez. Okay, what's doing that? I don't got time for your crap, you stupid little thing. Yeah, we did it! Hey, Thalamus, he's the guy who was make who made all the puzzles around here. Yeah! So a lot of this is we take the fruit itself and make seeds from that fruit, which then lets us turn around and grow nice things. 
I'm not sure what else is going on here. I don't know how deep this goes, or if it's just solid brick. I'm kind of curious, though, which is... That looks like a lot like it's just gonna be solid brick. See, I'm always curious when you get something like that, where there's clearly nothing over here. It's open otherwise, thin walls on the outside, but there's nothing back there. It's just solid. So did they bother... Did they make it hollow? Did they put something in there? More locked doors. Something we can't do anything about at the moment, but... There's a door on the other one, I just didn't see it. Couple nice presents along the way. Kinda lookout is that it's solid. Yeah, so not a lot going on over here. This is just the upper part of what we saw before. Yeah. Seems like we're good. There's just the little rooms there, and that's it. So away we go. Alright, we've done all kinds of stuff now. So until next time, everyone, it's nighttime, and nighttime is dangerous, but boy, let me tell you, tomorrow, I'm gonna do all kinds of stuff.